What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Redemption 46 Studios. I'm Nick. Man, y'all seen the picture, y'all seen the thumbnail. Y'all know exactly why y'all here. For Sistar, No More, My Boy, MV. Um, this is your first time on the channel. Stop what you're doing. Hit that subscribe button. Become a real redeemer today for more content like this. Jump on the Patreon. Man, shout out to Jules. Jules, as soon as you hit me up, I have seen this dropped. And I just was like, damn. Like, you know, it's been a minute since we did the Sistar stuff. I know Sistar 19 is supposed to be the subunit. Um, man, we, we, we could jump into it, man. I know Sistar, shout out to them. I know they mean a lot to a lot of people. I know these are the type of groups that got people into K-pop. And these are the type of groups that built the foundation of, like, you know, what K-pop is. And kind of, I don't want to say crawled so some groups can run. Um, but you know, I, I got a lot of respect for the groups that, that did a lot of the groundwork. Um, so yeah, no long talk. We could jump into this and see what's up with the what's up. Uh, let me make sure this is 4K'd up, turned all the way up. Let's jump into this. Yes, shit, you is. <laughs> saying that but <laughs> First off, man, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. For more content like this, jump on the Patreon. Um, oh, I feel like I might have missed up. Yo, can we have a moment of silence, man? 
God, God be. Women are the most beautiful things on this on this planet, man. Like God really took his time uh making these uh lovely women right here. Like shout out to their mom, shout out to their dad, just shout out to those jeans. Like It's not fair, man. Um You know, a weaker man wouldn't have been paying attention to the production of the song, their voices, and everything else. But I'm glad I'm such a professional that I was able to take in all this beauty. Um, just you know, all, all that that was the that was the one. That was the one. So yeah, man, we can state the obvious, you know what I mean? Like they're beautiful. Um, I like the aesthetic and everything too. I like the whole snow um, slash like cowboy, uh, like the rodeo type of look and everything. Um, it was very decent. It felt very cinematic as well. The production on here was, was dope though. I like the whole sound and the whole vibe that they were going for for the song. Definitely like high energy. Um, and it was high energy enough for you to have like a high tempo with the choreography um but also be able to do like some of those subtle movements and everything all like that um <laughs> just a blessing man. <laughs> like we've talked about this before too like it's been probably like a running thing on the channel but uh women within the second gen or especially like in the uh, beginning stages of the third gen and obviously, you know, since, you know, they're older and everything like that, even when we look at like when they debuted or kind of like when, when people were like coming out, there was a different like sex appeal um, towards like some of those groups. And maybe some of those groups were marketed that way. So it kind of came across a little bit of such. Um, but they, they definitely like own it. Like you can feel it in their struts, their walk, their, their like whip bags. Um, just a certain level of like sex appeal that's like very mature and very like grown and it feels like it captivates so they can like pull you in from wherever they're at in the room. Um, shout out to the uh, the stylist and everything too. I always say like it's within the K world it's very hard to like get certain looks off um, and make them like your own just because you know at the end of the day how many people do y'all think have done like a cowboy look within K-pop and everything? I'm sure a lot of people, um, but, you know, they were able to pull this off just miraculously. Um, just, you know, really did they thing. I also like that concept, too, on here. They keep doing, like, the broken bottles and, like, you're trying to patch it up. And sometimes, no matter how many times you fix something, it, it would just never be the same. <laughs> um, so, you know, I kind of uh, like that concept and, and the subtlety kind of in that. Um <laughs> Scars bar. Um, so, yeah, so I like that. I wonder what the, the people jumping on these comments and like get into it yet. <laughs> Sister 19 is the only girl group who can deliver a sexy concept with class. That's what I meant, though. Um, like, they don't got to be too like vulgar or anything. Well, and you got people whose first time listening to this. It's been 11 years and I still don't disappoint <laughs> since I saved K-pop again. Congrats on the comeback. Queen is back. Best comeback of the century. Subunit of the second. Gen of K-pop. Love them so much. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to um, think. Because even as far as like our sister stuff, I felt like we might have done like two reactions or something like that from them. So we haven't even had an opportunity to kind of like dive into like you know all of the content and everything but i i want more <laughs> a lot more um i'm very interested to, uh to to see how everybody else feels about this as well i definitely want to show my sisters too to see how they like this journey there's a lot of different concepts and everything like that I love her tattoos um gotta find out more about bora 
Does she have solo work? Have we? Has anybody even had, like talked? To, like, have we done that? Have we done a song with hers? And I haven't known. Cause sometimes we'll um, sometimes we'll do somebody's track, and it might get mentioned like kind of one time, and that's kind of it. It gonna make me want to see something. Hold on. Okay, no, nah, no, nah, we haven't. Um, get yeah, it, man, and then the, no more from me. Honestly, like I said, wanna um, wanna get a little bit more information on them just in general and kind of see what's up with the what's up because let me see. Yeah, I'm trying to see y'all if it's any other videos or anything kind of just from them in general. And I see it's more of the Sistar stuff. Okay, yeah, the stuff that I'm seeing looks like it's 10 years old, go, going not around any longer. So, because I'm seeing Sister 19, my boy choreography, practice version from 12 years ago. So, is this a song that they did kind of before y'all that they kind of just, um, like, kind of, you know, either reimagined or just did it again kind of like a different way? Because I keep seeing that. And the other only song from 10 years ago I'm seeing is uh, Going Not Around Any Longer. That's interesting, but you know who's going to give me all the good information? <laughs> y'all, um, jump in the comments, y'all. Let me know more about this because uh, I'm very intrigued to kind of see what's up with the what's up. Uh, more fire content like this coming soon. Love you guys. Mahalo at y'all. Peace.